hi guys so today i actually want to make a quick video to talk about this particular picture here okay so um about a few days ago one of my students sent this picture to me and asked me what could probably have caused this person this particular damage this much and i'm going to be giving you guys three good reasons why this person's back turned out to be this way a lot of people will probably conclude that oh it's probably because this person is bleaching that's why her skin turned out that way but the funny thing is that might not be the primary reason although i'm not entirely saying that is not the reason okay no. the first reason that could have caused this is lack of using sunscreen sunscreen as we all know is actually uh, a uv protector uv is ultraviolet rays that is the rays of sun sunlight that is that can harm our skin okay and we have uva and uvb ultraviolet a ultraviolet b the one in charge of making us age fast and the one in charge of giving us sunburn sun damage and other skin issues okay so now the first step to avoiding this kind of thing from happening to you is to constantly always wear sunscreen and i have these questions from several people that say what kind of sunscreen can i use and all of that if you are in africa where it's almost hot every time of the day every year all day every day then i would advise you use spf 60 and above spf means sun protection factor 60 and now, if you're outside the country, then you could bring between 30 and above, okay? I mean, that would do. And then we have a lot of sunscreen that can penetrate easily on the skin. Some people say they don't like sunscreen because it actually creates white cast. I think that will probably be an, an, another video entirely. Now, the second thing that must have caused this particular case is usage of products under the sun, okay? Or let me just say usage of whitening products. Now, see... Anything that has an iota of whitening ingredients in them, you are not expected to use this particular product out in the sun without protecting your skin. That is, if you have whitening lotion, whatever lotion it is that your brand sells to you, that has an iota of whitening ingredients in them, don't use them during the day. Especially if you're in this part of the world, which is Africa, where it is almost hot every goddamn day. You should not cream and enter the sun. So even if you are the type that you cannot do without creamy, then you can get a moisturizer that you can use during the day. I mean, a day moisturizer, something that is very, very good to be used during the day. Probably a body butter or body oil that has no lightening ingredients in them. Okay. Now, the third reason is the usage of harmful products. Okay. Products that are probably high in hydroquinone, um, steroids. These kind of products are the... Um, are the worst kind of product that you could ever apply on your skin during the day trust me guys first of all i preach against all these three ingredients or this kind of product that is if your product contains steroids clobetasol hydroquinone and some other harsh skincare ingredients that should not be used in your product except if specifically prescribed by a dermatologist this kind of ingredient if they are included in your product and you use these products during the day you are going to see the adverse i mean the other side of this um product okay so i'm not going to list any products that contain this because i disclaimer i do not want this to be targeted at any company so i don't want you to feel like as if i'm directing this video at any particular company okay so just check your product check the kind of product you use the first reason is lack of using sunscreen second thing is when you use products that contains iota of lightning ingredients when you use them out in the sun the third one is usage of product that contains some certain skincare ingredients like hydroquinone globeta sauce steroids and other things usage of those kind of products without proper prescription of a dermatologist these ingredients are meant to be used to actually treat certain kind of areas for you to treat certain kind of skin issues they are not supposed to be used as your everyday lotion or your go-to product to apply on your skin on every blessed day so if you can stay do all these three that i just said you would not be experiencing something like this we have other reasons if you want a part two drop a comment